Welcome, guys. Back to another video. Back to LA, back to Fifth Couple Foodies, back to... Reality. <laughs> and the epic cheat day. It's our ultimate Fifth Couple freaking cheat day. Yeah, I'm so excited. And I'm so hungry that I wanna... Yeah. And today, we were thinking, we're gonna start up with as normal donuts. Look where we are. DK. DK. It's not the best donut in the lab, but it's really good. It's really good. Um, and we're going to be totally freaking disgusting this first part of the video. <laughs> and we don't mind. We don't care. No. Because we are so freaking hungry. hungry. So we're going to get it in. Uh, we are going to get in. So yep. we're going to get in. We're going to pick our donuts. We're going to buy it all the way home. We're going to be even more sweaty than we are right now. And then we're going to start this freaking day off. Let's go. go. Take me to Neverland. We are oh. back home with a lot of donuts! <laughs> Yay! Because and you guys missed the donuts last time, right? <laughs> I don't know how many DMs we got saying or comments. Where's sorry. the donuts? Like, uh, sheet day without donuts? What the heck? Yeah, but here they are. <gasps> oh my gosh! And we did try some new donuts today yep. that we never tried before. But of course, we'll, we got the cronuts and an apple fritter. Yeah, because and we three cronuts. Yes! Insane, bruh! You are so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. When we were at DK, the only thing I heard when Ida talks is Henrik, can we take many donuts today? I think this is pretty much. No, it's not. Yeah, she's crazy. <laughs> she's crazy, so crazy about sugar. I have never met anyone who so much donuts as I can. Exactly. Uh, guys, as we said before, welcome back to another video. So if you are tuning in for the first time, welcome, I'm Ida, this is Henrik. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> we are Fight Fit Couple Foodies. Fight Couple Foodies. <laughs> Fit Couple Foodies, nice. straight from LA. Yeah. Uh, so please consider to subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up if you, as we, if you love like donuts. Yeah. It might suck there, I was gonna say. Yeah. Hell, but it's all fair, right? <laughs> um, and today, the theme of the video is, of course, to have an ultimate freaking cheat day yeah. for a big couple. Uh, yeah, we, today, we think so. Yes, because the weather today is awful. So we're gonna stay in. We're gonna do like movies on day and stuff. Maybe we can start uh, the Star Wars uh, marathon. What do you guys think? Do you like Star Wars? Comment down below. Meanwhile, we're eating these donuts, these amazing donuts from DK's. We are going to talk about our fitness journey, yeah. where we started, where we ended up. Or the, the training journey, like in yeah. general, oh. how we started. Yeah, but okay, should we? Should, should we? We should start with the donut now, but I have no idea which one. I don't okay, know. What yeah. The, okay, yeah. Okay, original cronut, eat up. You can go first today oh. because I was first the next time. The first, the first time? The, the last the, time? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. okay, you have to hear this. Shh. A lovely crunch mm. there. And voila. Mm -hmm. Flaky! Mm -hmm. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm. Oh yeah, right. Oh. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Damn the cronut at SK. Damn the cronut at DK is really good. So the history behind our fitness were actually just training uh, history. Yeah. Did I say that twice? <laughs> or and twice. It, or twice. Did you say that? <laughs> so we actually come from a totally different background. Henrik, <coughs> what about you? 
I'm going in for the fritter. I am a, <coughs> a sports guy right in my bone. I am born a sport. I am born to be a sportsman. Yeah. Because the only thing we did when we grew up was play hockey on the streets, yeah, football, everything. And then I, I choose to put all my effort into ice hockey. Uh, so that was what I did um, until I were 23. So a lot of years, I miss it every day. Uh, yeah, until I was 23. And then after my ice hockey career, or what to say, yeah, I play the third league in Sweden. I Division one. Division one. And, Sorry, I missed the next thing. And uh, I start to fell more and more to the bodybuilding way. So I did this. I did the ice hockey with the bodybuilding a lot of years. But then I realized that I wanna just do fitness. Yeah. Or Feeling something. the weights. Feeling the weights. Yeah, it's so fun. Sorry, I just need to try this. So before Henrik even has me taking one bite, I'm gonna smother in my favorite freaking peanut butter. Sorry for disturbing, I just need to say this. Oh my this. god, that looks so good. Mm -hmm. Alright, right. mm. let's test it on. How was the apple fritten? How was the apple fritten from the DKS? Good? Oh, it's thick! Yeah. Just let me tell you that. This was a small one. But, mm -hmm. dude, that's different. It's a lot of cinema, mm -hmm. more than I have ever felt. 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 Um, but have you? Yeah. So have you been try? Uh, have you like been thinking about competing or anything? No, competing for me. I just love to do this as a lifestyle. Actually, mm -hmm. well, you never say never, but I don't think so right now. Yeah. So I'm a hockey guy from the beginning. That's why I have some big ass. <laughs> big thighs, maybe? Big too. thighs, yeah. Um, so, and for me, um, I have always been into lifting things that's heavy. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm gonna say one thing about Ida. She can't handle those balls. <laughs> 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 okay, well, I surely You know what I mean. Uh, oh, no. What the heck is that on English? I have no idea. Ball sense. It's a lot. That's ball the name. sense, yeah. Yeah, the ball sense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ida has an, the best ball scent in the world. So that's why you. Yeah, continue. Yeah. So, we. I grew up in a family with five girls living under the same roof and we all are artistic in many many different ways so it was a lot of dancing, singing, makeup things a lot of very girly stuff to say it like that um, and dad he fought kind of hard to get us active and stuff like that more than just dancing because we were like always active and always doing things so they they tried letting us into the track and field, volleyball my dad, he was a marathon runner, so I was kind of prone to hard work and very long <laughs> sessions. And then when I was 14, I found a gym at a barn <laughs> in my hometown. Yeah. Um, yeah. Guys. So regarding gym, let's hit the protein cake donut. Yeah, this is a protein donut. Yeah. Let's go. As a protein cake donut. Okay, I'm going to wait until he says anything. Um, and I had already been starting to like lift things on the out, like out on the a yard, like tires, logs, and stuff like that because I thought it was fun. Then I found a gym, so and hard. the owner, he was like the only bodybuilder in town. Such a small town, small town, but he was so good uh, at what he was doing, and he kind of became my mentor. 
mentor. Yeah. Pretty good. Wow, this is red velvet. Yeah. Mm. Red velvet. Mm. Look inside, guys. But I don't know. So I don't know about you guys, but when I was a teenager, I kind of let all my social life and school and work getting like interfere with my sportsmanship or my activity level. So it was like on and off, and I did I was not consistent consistent as I am today. Um, but I I was there. I was at the gym. Sometimes a few days per week and then sometimes just like once or twice uh, Or even not at all um, But the passion for bodybuilding was born right there So yeah, Heck that's yeah. where it all started Until I moved from that town and the interest for like the real bodybuilding part of my life started The compete thing? Yeah Yeah so I, it's 15 years ago since I started, but it's 10 years ago I started like really mentally preparing myself for Take being... Take time, guys. So don't forget that. And it also takes a lot of planning. It takes a lot of consistency, as I said. And also a lot of trust in yourself that you can do it. Yeah. And also nutrition. Yeah, that's so big part. Half of it or more, mm -hmm. I would say. So that's what we're gonna get into now before going deeper in that. But just before. <laughs> okay. One bite of the. Okay, let's go through the pebble. Oh. Guys, look at this beauty. That's your choice. Yeah, this is my choice. I have never eaten a donut or a cronut with fruity pebbles on it, and I see everybody does it, so. See how it is. Come on, come on. I agree with that. Mm -hmm. Give it to me. Wow. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. Mm. That crunch is freaking amazing. Wow. That's so fresh. And with the frosting, the frosting mm. is not too sweet either. No. It's actually so good. Wow. This is a straight freaking nine, nine out of ten. Oh, look, 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 look. So yeah, this brings us to one of the subjects that we want to address today. Mm. Uh, we still got a lot of questions regarding but how can you eat like this when you stay so lean. Mm. And it has been taking us years to find this out. It has been taking us studies, like actually reading studies regarding fitness and health and everything. It has been taking experience both from ourselves and our clients and it just all comes down to realizing your own maintenance and to do that it takes patience because it will not happen overnight if you're not like um, able to get to a clinic who can um, actually exactly uh, calculate how much you expand throughout the day both resting and your yeah. activity level or you're just like moving along at your house and how much you eat so to be able to stay the way that we are and yes sometimes we uh, put on some weight and sometimes we drop some weight but that's yeah. just because we calculate for a full week yeah and not only day per day, day, per day. Um, and also it's so easy for us to do that because we know exactly how much we can eat on that, say, Saturday because we eat a little, a little bit more on Saturdays. We just put the calories down yeah. on Sunday. So, and yeah. we still eat a lot yeah. because we are, in, we are very highly active. Yeah, so we, we still eat, but we eat uh, very clean and wholesome food yeah. that keeps us more saturated. Like, yeah. We feel full because yeah. we eat a lot of fibers and stuff. But to calculate this, to keep track of ourselves, we have an amazing app that we want to give you a little bit tip, tips, give you a little hint about. So we are actually using an app called LiveSum. Yeah. You can download it straight on your App Store or Androids. 
yeah. for I'm not sure what that the name of that app store is, but get yourself I don't know either. The live sum. Android. Yeah. Android. <laughs> it's available everywhere and you can have, no matter where you live in the world, you can use it. Yeah. And it's so easy, actually it's so amazing. You can also choose if you wanna go that, that I like that so much with you can actually choose if you are pretty new in this game, in this lifestyle. You can choose if you want to build muscle, go vegan. Yeah. They have a lot of choices. That's yeah. really and good. a lot of recipes as well. So life on a on a lifestyle like ours is never freaking boring thanks to this app. So we will put a link in the description box below to give you a, a freaking good discount to download the premium version of it so you can track your macros and your micronutrients and everything so you can keep on a healthy level throughout the week yeah and regard, eat yeah. donuts in the weekends if that's whatever. what you want to do or in the monday or tuesday or, or is it that one yes or is it that one so that's that's the insight that's how we do it we just keep control of how we eat but we never go Hungry. We do not starve ourselves to be able to do this cheat days. No. This is our lifestyle and we love it and we are very thankful for an app like LifeSum. So I will like press a little bit in the app for you on the screen here so you can see how easy it is. So I will put in a few of the, these donuts and then tonight I will calculate everything. Like the total intake of the day. Uh, but yeah. Now I'm intrigued. I don't think you like that one. Mm. You didn't like it. Mm. The raspberry is not that good. I don't think so. Mm. But it's fresh. It's fresh. Mm. Mm -hmm. So that's a little bit of insight for you. Just saying. So we do it. So let's dig into these three last donuts. We are freaking fast when it comes to donuts. We are going to try the matcha. Matcha latte. I think, I think it's filled. No, it's not. Yeah, filled. because it's like dots in the bottom. Mm. I think they have. I don't know it. Mm. Mm. Well, I don't think so. Okay, matcha. I've never tried it, and I don't think. This is good. You don't? I want to let you in on another secret. I need to shower. <laughs> I'm so nasty right now. How was it? That's different. Oh, was it different? Does it taste like tea? Mm. It tastes like... Spirulina, I don't think. It tastes weird. No, I don't like that. Actually, guys, I think that was the first time I, I say something is bad on our channel because I like everything. Yeah, I like this one. So I'm gonna take it. I want to take a bite of this one. Yeah. Woo! Nice! He screwed up my Nutella Krona. It's Nutella everywhere. Damn. <laughs> Oh. It was like a Buddha. Oh. Mm. I'm gonna dunk this. Mm, this is so good. Double U. Double U. Mm hmm. That's a good donut. Giving you every So here is. Woohoo! Look at this. It's Nutella on the inside, it's Nutella on top, and on the floor. <laughs> yeah, and on the teeth. Listen to this. And like this. A little bit. Mm. So this is a sugar... Sugar Krona. Mm. What do you say? A sugar coated Krona, maybe? Mmm, mmm, Nutella. But I like the glaze more. 
Yeah, the glazed one is better. Much than the better. Sugar. Yeah. Is this mine? Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> that was so good. Mm. DK, you nailed it today. Mm. It was so good. Best time ever from their place. Yeah, absolutely. Best time ever. So, yeah. I'm time happy. to clean up. Time to clean up. Time to take a shower <laughs> and uh, get ready for the next meal. Yep. See you in a millisecond. going for Thai food. <laughs> so we actually realized that we didn't have anything at home to stay in the entire night as we said in the last clip. So we are heading towards Ralph's but then we realized we needed something right now so we stopped at a Thai restaurant that we have been craving for such a long time. So take a look at this one. So what we got here. <laughs> the food has arrived and it's a uh, Pad Thai with shrimp and chicken. Yep. It's freaking bomb. Yep. It's a red curry with There beef it is. Oof, that and looks some so rice. Good. That looks so yummy. Bomb. And egg rolls. And the egg rolls. I'm so excited. Let's, Let's dig in. in. Okay, I'm gonna start with the Pad Thai. We are heading into the the curry, the red curry with beef, and it looks insane. I love red curry. Good. Almost better. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. Curry. Mm. Wow. Ooh. Mm. This is such a small place. Look at it. Yep, that's it. And here am I, eating some egg rolls, enjoying life. <laughs> so cute. Done and done. See you in a millisecond. The two of us always failing. Because now we're. You tackle full. me? Yes. Yeah, we feel pretty full. <laughs> Whoa. That was lame. No. <laughs> so the Thai food, boss, it was pretty good. How was it? It was really good. I would say probably seven, uh, seven like out of ten. Six out of ten. That's not good at all. Yeah, but yeah, it was decent. Okay. But Thai food never wows me. No, but uh, it was pretty good. But Ralph's wows but the, me. The Pad Thai was, wasn't that good. No. But the red curry is always nice. I love curry. And now we are at Ralph's and we're gonna see what we want more for tonight. So... It's gonna be a hard choice because now we're full. Yeah. We know the dessert, like, or if, like, you, we know the ice Oh my god, guys, you have to stay tuned for that because this dessert today oh. is the most most wanted dessert in America right now because everybody want to have it and we have it. We so, have it. But the thing is, I might want to have a dessert before the dessert. Yeah, you, yeah. I want to have a, I want to have cheese. Guys, I think you should apply for one day with Ida. You're going to get so much sugar coma for that day. Okay. <laughs> so you can apply down below here if you want to spend a day, day with, with her. Me. Yeah. <laughs> one day with the sugar coma. That sugar coma. Mm. Yeah, you get definitely gonna but what go there. What do we have for dinner there. then? I don't know. Oh, I want a Powerade. Okay, so let's see you back home. Yeah. So we're gonna try to decide what to eat. <laughs> it's dinner time! Oh. And we said wow. that tonight or today would be a 
a day at home. Yeah, a Just cozy day at home. With relaxing, with Netflixing and chilling the entire yeah. day. So That's... we're actually currently looking at a movie. Yeah. Do you know the name? It's not happened often, so we really need this. Yeah, so we actually, again, ordered takeout. Because I don't know if you guys remember, but we said we have never ordered takeout. And then we <laughs> kind of started, and then we were kind of hooked. Yeah, so last time it was Domino's, as you saw a few videos down here. Uh, today, it's freaking Pizza Hut. Yes, because we have not tried it on this YouTube. No. And we have tried it before, but we didn't like it. No. So this is a redemption. But it looks really good. Yes. So what did we take? Should we start from there or from this? We can start here. Okay. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> this freaking pasta. You're gonna burn yourself. No. Okay. Check this out. So that's a chicken alfredo pasta. Wow. Yep. Yeah. And then we took. Not what I expected, but hey. Same. The chicken parmesan uh, boneless wings. They look better. I yeah, they look much better on the yeah. They look the crispy side. Yeah. on the pictures, but you should never go for the pictures, babe. Now they are wet. Yes, and yeah. Last but not least, because this is a big, humongous pizza. Yeah. Should we show them? Come on. Okay. 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 Woo oh my god. We got half a pepperoni and we have a chicken and bacon. The pizza looks really good. And it's stuffed crust. That was the thing last time. We I, I think we we thought that we got a stuffed, a stuffed crust. crust, but it's, it wasn't. So today it's yeah, it's stuffed. I think I wanna start with the pizza. Look at the cheese. Yes. Look here, look here. Oh, yeah. oh my god. Wow. I don't know what I'm gonna. Start. And the thing is, we have three dressings. We have the garlic, we had, uh, have our favorite the chili, chipotle aioli. Wow. And we got the creamy ranch. And we Damn, have we got some there. good food here. Okay, let's get into this. I'm gonna. Cozy day. I'm gonna talk with it, yeah. I like this day. Yeah, me too. Okay, it's let's perfect start. during final weeks. Yeah. Okay. okay. Cheers. First, first without sauce, okay? Yes. Cheers, guys. Mmm. Mmm. I want to. Wow, really... the bacon. Mmm. Wow. It's really nasty. Mmm. Mmm. And we took the. I think we have Alfredo on the bottom here as well. Yeah. And I don't think this one needs any dipping. What do you think about the pizza? It's not Domino's. It's not Domino's. No, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a big fan of Domino's. But I'm more a fan of Stella Bara. So no, this does not cut it, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. You have to see the cheese. Yeah, that's amazing. Cheese inside was really good. I don't know if you can see it, but... Because mm. if I move too close to the camera, I'm gonna have a pizza on my floor. Okay, let's try the pepperoni. Yeah. The dough is a little bit yeah uh, uncooked. I think they yeah. like five more minutes in the oven. Yeah, should we put it in our oven? Oven? No. Pepperoni. We could if you want to. No. That's what I meant. Mm. Wow. But pizza, guys. Pizza. It's I don't know what it is. Special. Because sometimes I would have, I would love to have pizza, mm. but most often I love eating the freaking burgers. Yeah. What's your choice? Would it be pizza or burger? Hashtag your thing. Oh, no, but this is actually insane. Mm. I almost want a picture of this one. This is a perfect pepperoni. Yeah. But I'm too messy. I wanna eat. Mm. 
Wow. Wow, that was good. Whoa. And I, some health and fitness, as many others would say. Yeah. Cheers. Diet Coke. Damn, that mix between the garlic dip and the aioli. Bomb. I think we should try it. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. Okay. Pasta. And I will go for a win. Is this the Alfredo? Mm-hmm. <laughs> every time every time every time that I see your face it always makes me smile mm. okay I'll go and take a bite of the chicken mm. better than it looks yeah Ooh. yeah but I have to show you this is mm. Creamy, creamy alfredo. Damn, it's good. Look at it. It's kind of nice. I like it. You're gonna love it. And I'm gonna double dip this. In the parmesan. And I don't care if someone takes offense of that. I'm a double dipper. That's how it is. You wanna try one? Mmm. Okay, so pasta alfredo. Ricora. Mm. And Ida is an alfredo fan. She's gonna love it. Yes, I know it. I knew it. Mm. It's a bad alfredo. Was it? Yeah, it's lame. It and lame? They, it's just so like out from a freezer and into an oven. Mm. Five bucks. Mm. Six bucks. Mm. That's decent because there is a big plate. Pretty big plate. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> wow, but this was amazing. The pizza was... good. Yeah. So what are you lot. doing with the pizza? It was easier to dip it. Yeah, but you're like losing all of the... I'm losing it! I'm losing it! I'm losing it! What's... Then I'm going to eat it all. Okay, a secret. That guy... He it... gets like... You know what I'm going to say, right? If he finds a song that he loves, he yeah. will play it to the end yeah. of time. So if he finds a song that he absolutely loves... And also sing it the whole day. Yes. So it's like non-stop. If he doesn't have it on his phone or the computer, he's singing it. Like... You have heard my great voice, so it <sighs> sounds pretty good in here. I'm losing it. Stop it. Get some help.
gym training <laughs> and I let him like if I if I borrow his headphones just because of one <laughs> set or something guess what song it's on every single time Breaking Benjamin's Diary of Jade Something's getting in my way. Something... yeah this year <laughs> I think, you, how many play, times did it say that you had played that song? Like, I don't know, but it was number one. <laughs> and it's like, it's not just one time. Right. It's 15 to 20 times per set. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> you get so hooked up. Are you hooked up on me too? Yeah, okay. I am. Are you full? <laughs> not full, full. Here I, comes the pasta. What was the second song I had? It was a, like a Norwegian uh, loser, oh. loser song. <laughs> what is it? Russian song. <laughs> what is it? Mm? Russian song. What is it? I drink my full, and I get idle. I drink my full, just want to get idle. Like that. Like that. Pure art. I actually have kind of a great time with that one. I feel young. <laughs> Forever young! I want to be. Yeah, I'm a weirdo. Or the little red. Are you full? I, I think I'm done. What are you doing with the pizza? That's yours. No? Yes, it is. is. It? Yes. Oh, I thought it was Dicto. No, I, it was I told you. This is a juicy piece of bread in here. Yeah. There's a lot of carbs. The main event of the evening! Amazing ultimate ultimate? Yeah, yes. cheat day. <laughs> ultimate cheat day. Yeah. Um this is the dessert that we have been hyping up about. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, yeah, you can see the brand. It's freaking biscoff. It's freaking biscoff. Okay, so I'm super excited. We have pimped this up. I think I'm gonna like the sea salt. I think Best. so too, but should we start here, go there, and last one to chocolate? Yeah. Okay, so... Oh my god. This is... The Biscoff Sea Salt Caramel, topped with white Kit Kat, uh, white Twix, and some Biscoff. So actually, this is the three of four. We yeah. Actually, we couldn't get the fourth, because... They that were was, out. Uh, they were out, yeah. And that's the sure. original. So we at least we got the we are rather than you because yeah, although I feel like the it's 
very soft. Oh, it's something in here. Wow. Oh, it's something in here. Okay. It tastes so much cookie butter. And a lot of cookie spread inside. Oh. Um. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. And it starts to melt. Yeah. Wow. Okay. That was really good. And second flavor. Blueberry cheesecake. Wow. Mm. I think this one could be really good too. This was insane. Ooh, smell the blueberry. Actually authentic blueberry. Wow. That's so fresh with the blueberries. And the third one is chocolate brownie. Chocolate brownie. Mmm. That's so fresh. Mm. Did you like what the chocolate I thought? One? A lot of chocolate. And I don't like just chocolate. So, that was my least favorite. You feel me, right? Mm. But it's good. Mm. I need to try this is off camera again. Mm. Is there something missing? Yeah. I don't know what it is, but... It's not a bit Ben & Jerry's. Still not a Ben & Jerry's. Yeah, Ben & Jerry's is still better. So, yeah, we actually knew that we weren't supposed to need anything else in these ice creams. We just wanted it for a picture. Yeah. Pimp them up. I would choose the Magnum, the Ben and & Jerry's, and even the Private Selection Sea Salt Caramel before those. Yeah. Yeah, you think so too? Yes. Yeah. Because it's something that's missing. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it's just like, it's not like over and over and over the top like Ben & Jerry's. It's not bad. No, I mean, it's absolutely not bad. It's just not as good as we expected, I think. Yeah, right? that's, yeah, I agree. Because we were like hyping this up yeah. so bad because we love Biscoff. Oh, Kit Kat. It's, oh, that would be our last share for today. Mm. I remember a few weeks ago, I said I don't like Kit Kat. Are but you? then I tried the white Kit Kat and I love Kit Kat. The white one. Yeah, I don't like the brown one. Mm. And now I feel satisfied. Me too. I don't need to eat anything more. So with that said... Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um. <laughs> we have such a blast filming these videos. Yeah. And taking fun. you along with the ride of our epic eats yeah. and today was super super good yeah so as we said but guys the best thing today was the fruity pepper fruity pebble fruity pebble 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 fruity pebble grown up yay that was the best for me I don't know what was best for 10 me. out of 10 and the donuts today was 10 out of 10. Yep. So if you're ever in LA, go get your DK donuts and make sure they are fresh. Yeah. Because that's when they are the best. Yeah. Okay, guys. guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Come on, say it We'll see you guys at the next episode. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> see you guys. Very, very soon. Shortly. Night. <laughs> See you guys very, very soon. Do you say it's not butter? See you guys very, very, very soon. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs>
Hello, Mira. 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 Hello,